be present uh, for our group is uh, stay in the now, be present, uh, show up, um, do your job today. So pretty simple message for our group. Uh, carry over from second half of last, last game, that uh, awareness and sense of uh, competitive spirit that we had to start with that tonight. I won't complicate this thing. Right, we're going we're gonna to start five, game, five guys, and they're going to go out and play extremely hard, and we got six more dudes that could help. Um, we're hoping to get healthy. Um, but whoever, whoever puts on the Brooklyn Nets jersey is going to play. And uh, I, I promise you I'm not going to complicate it more than that. This is always an uh, a interesting time for the, for the guys in the locker room. Uh, it, it just is. I've tried to make it as normal as possible that if any guy has a question uh, to come to me and I can be as plain and, and simple as possible. Um, it, it is indeed like the, the need for certainty is the, the greatest disease of the mind can ever face for sure. And um, um, guys who don't have certainty right now, uh, we could try to keep it as simple as possible for them. Show up. Be focused. Be present. Uh, you, you have no control of what's going to happen tomorrow. Be present today. Let's take advantage of this opportunity that we have to go play and go compete. And that's what I said to the group through walkthrough. And uh, they, they know I, my message to them has been pretty consistent. And uh, hopefully that, that helps them through this, Howard. And, um, uh, but any questions, they can come and, and I can give them some clarity, hopefully. My conversation with Kev uh, basically was based around the game and how uh, our group pulled together to get a win. Uh, he was enthusiastic by that, uh, how our guys played, how Cam played. Uh, so our conversation is really kind of geared towards that direction. And um, that was really about it. At the end of the day, Kevin wants to win. And uh, that's always been uh, our goal. Um, he wants to win at shoot around. He wants to win. Um, any game of the week, that's why he loves to play. That's why he wants to play 82 games. Uh, that will be our holy grail. Uh, we'll continue to try to put a group out that wins. And uh, until there's something for me to be concerned about, then uh, I'll carry on business as usual.